Hey, speaking of perverse, let's check in on Dave Rubin's project uh, in uh, being the last liberal. Um, he now, now just to, just recap here, just so we can put this in context. Dave Rubin was a liberal. He says, uh, what, like ten years ago, eight years ago, a seven years liberal, ago, like a box, five liberal. or six years ago. When was it? I mean, he left TYT what, like eight years ago? Around that. Before yeah, I'd say you know it probably around when he started um, being IDW five years ago was when he really started going conservative. But he would have called himself a liberal back then. Oh, he too. certainly was calling yeah. himself. He was calling himself the last liberal. Right. Um, so he was a liberal, let's say in the teens the 20 teens you know what i mean just i just want to put that in context because now he claims he he actually was even misplaced then uh and i want you to just watch a couple of things one you know uh dave rubin speaking so you, you can tell that it's going to be somewhat uh, incomprehensible like in you know two the amount of sweat pouring off this guy i don't know if it was because he's nervous or it was really hot in the auditorium and uh, three, uh, just how much this crowd loves him. So it's funny, a few people have asked me uh, here, you know, Dave, well, do you, do you still call yourself a liberal? Does it make sense to call yourself a liberal? And, you know, unfortunately, I don't have a DeLorean and a flux capacitor, and I can't go back to France in 1780 where I could say I was a liberal with a straight face. I have no problem. I am actually quite proud to stand in front of you and tell you that I'm a conservative. I, I have no problem doing that whatsoever. That you can applaud. That, I, thought, I thought that was going to be a big... Thought. People aren't used to live performances again. You guys know I'm live, right? We're doing this. It's fully live. I'm a human. No tape delay here. We're all sitting in Zoom boxes all day long. It's crazy. You see what they've done to us? They've made us all crazy. You can see a human in front of you. Is that a real person? I can't believe it. I mean, but okay. To, to have the confidence every time you bomb to blame it on society like that, this is because we're all in Zoom boxes. <laughs> right. It's well, the liberals making this crazy. That's why I had to Jeb Bush the audience. Exactly. That's why I had to remind you that uh, you should be excited that I'm conservative and clap for me now. But the other part that I found interesting about that is that not only is it like it's society's fault I'm not funny, but also they, they put us in Zoom boxes. Who's the Z? Who's the they? Well, he's bringing it back to like what conference is this? Is this at right? It's 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 he thinks it's easy chum. It's easy applause to say the liberals. Yeah, they made us go indoors and quarantine and COVID's a hoax. Whatever. Yeah, it was it was the liberals. That's why I I refused to leave my compound because of the liberals. I would have kept going out of my compound. In fact, I probably would have driven Uber, uh, but it was the liberals. Gavin Newsom wouldn't let me go out and, I don't know, I guess I could have volunteered or maybe just gotten a job at uh, the supermarket to provide stuff, but I didn't want to because I couldn't because of Gavin Newsom and they. Was he saying that the French Revolution, like I kind of got lost in his flux capacitor stuff, but like the French Revolution, <laughs> he would have gone back that like he would have been conservative back then already no he would have he he would have been able to call himself i think what he's saying is that i could refer to myself as a classical liberal if i lived in france in the you know uh 18th century okay but like edmund burke is known as the father of conservatism kind of right and he, he was very against the everything going on in the french revolution well, maybe he would just be there in that era. Uh, and Straight out of the DeLorean. Out of the DeLorean. <laughs> That's where he'd go first. Hey, guys. I noticed that you're chopping off a lot of heads over there, but can you... <laughs> I think that's a little bit against what liberalism I understand it as. <laughs> exactly. You guys have really... Your, your, your liberalism has left mine. I didn't leave you. <laughs> the sense culottes left me. Oh my gosh. Oh man, he's really playing up. But I like how easily he slips back into stand up comedy mode there. Yeah, right? you don't think that was easy? Like, I, the thing about Dave is, like, these people that call themselves stand up comedians, but they're clearly more famous as online commentators. Oh, well, than, there's a, but, that's right. an audience of, or there's, there's a group of two. Well, Maybe. Maybe a few more, but yeah. 
Um, Two that I can think of off the top of my head. Never let him see you sweat. Well, I, he was really, that was really poor. Uh, take your coat off, bud. 